All right, welcome back. There are plenty of delicious dishes to make using strawberries, and we have Chef Dwight Smith here uh, to take us through three of them, and one of them is everybody's favorite. <laughs> Strawberry shortcake. Strawberry shortcake. Strawberry shortcake. First of all, what, what do you love about baking, cooking, anything with strawberries? What's your favorite part? The biggest thing that I love about California strawberries specifically is how versatile they are. Mm. I can get them in, you know, desserts, savory, um, snack, whatever, whatever <laughs> yeah. it is, it's all there. The one, and the one thing I've always find is when I buy a carton of strawberries, especially me, I'm living out, you know, I'm a bachelor single guy <laughs> living it myself. I always find that the carton, you know, doesn't really, I can't use the whole carton. These, this is a perfect way that you're making sure you're getting the most of every strawberry. Yeah, hopefully we show not only the versatility, but like how you can <laughs> how you can use that entire carton. All right, perfect. Let's uh, let's top this. So what have we been doing with these ones here? Okay, so what we did with these strawberries here is we macerated them in a little bit of sugar. So yeah. literally just a little bit of sugar. Yeah. Let it sit in a warm <laughs> place, and that juice just naturally comes okay. out. We have our beautiful... And you were hand mixing this uh, whipped cream. Yeah, no? Did I you, see that? Yeah. You have to. You have to. You have to. That's so, the specialty, yeah. So you get this nice, lovely uh, Chantilly, if you will, which okay. is just a little bit of vanilla in there. Yep. And then we put it on top of that nice sponge cake that we made. Yeah. And then I'll go ahead and let you uh, oh, yes. jump on these, uh, these strawberries. What's the trick in terms of like the juice to strawberry you know, ratio? You know, that's looking beautiful. Yeah? That's, you kind of okay. got it right, right there. Perfect. You, wanna, you, you want, don't want you don't want the too exactly. like, so, wet there. Exactly. So let me show you my trick. Sure, go for it. My you know your, your technique My here. trick is I take a little bit of the juice out when I first okay. put it on. You put it on like that just so that it kind of sits. And then you take all that nice little juice that came out. Yeah. Oh. And you just... Drizzle it right. All right, you cannot go wrong <laughs> uh, with that. But what else do we got here? So what are we working with over here? So over here we've got a uh, a, a beautiful ricotta toast. So mm. we've got those same California strawberries right on top. Uh, underneath that we've got a little bit of whipped ricotta. Okay. Okay. So what I did was uh, a little bit of lemon zest, um, a touch of sugar, um, and some honey. Okay. Sorry, not sugar, just a little bit <laughs> of honey. Just a little bit of honey, that's all you um, need. Eh? And then we spread that on top of a, of a crispy brioche. Yeah. Um, and then we top it with almonds, uh, some basil. Yeah. And that's what we're missing here, right? Just a little bit of a... And, little, and mint a little, goes on top of these strawberry shortcakes. Right exactly. Right there, right there. Exactly. Um, and another thing you don't always think of, but it's always a great addition to salads. So what do we got over here? This is really the star of the show right here. Yeah, so this is, this, is the, this is the savory application. We have a, uh, a, straw, a marinated strawberry salad yeah. with the Cajun blackened chicken on top. We've got a little bit of charred corn, almonds, sliced red onions. It's a game changer. Yeah, Brent's just yelled at me. So how would you, would you mix this all at once or so, would you kind of serve it? So and what do you got here? This is actually a, a strawberry vinaigrette as well. Mm -hmm. And again, you're not bind with the seasons with these strawberries either. They're available all year round. Yeah. Um, so give that a little drizzle. You oh. can see the color on that. Yeah, the color is beautiful. That is um, perfect. So that's like a little strawberry balsamic vinaigrette. Yeah. Um, and then, yes, now is when we, we give that a toss. Yes, everybody just, in the control room is watching just, this. I know and we just Brent put, just yelled at me because I moved it. I'm sure it was already perfectly framed in camera and then I had to move it. Oh, geez. Um, but you got enough here to feed the whole crew, which we is the great. Gang. Yeah, no um, problem. Again, Chef Dwight, where can people find more information about you? Um, okay, so you can usually, you can find me on Instagram yeah. uh, at Chef Dwight Smith. Um, as well as TikTok, and uh, we'll be starting a YouTube pretty soon. Yeah. And then in terms of uh, the California strawberries, you yeah. can absolutely find uh, some more information, lots of cool recipes at CaliforniaStrawberry.com. Okay. Um, and they're available in pretty much every grocery store across the country. Yeah. So year-round too and they're always fresh they're that's, always delicious that's the that's the reason why these are so much fun all right okay well i'm gonna dive in here right um i'm gonna maybe add a little bit more strawberries yeah, here I'm gonna, I'm gonna make you a special one okay a special one here we'll make you a special one so we are celebrating strawberries uh with chef dwight smith uh chef thanks so much for joining us today thank really you for having me all right here we go big bite there we go and thanks for watching on chch morning live oh it's all falling apart i was eating with my hands oh so good. <laughs> so good, my guy. Thank you. <laughs>